Hey guys, hope you're having a great, it was a great life. Dude, before we get into Jukebox Hero, channel update. We got a P.O. box, guys. Right? You guys have been asking for it for a pretty long time. We've been putting it off for months. Things get in the way, things happen, all that. All yeah, that does. we've had a bunch of people say, okay, where can we send you like old vinyls or t-shirts, whiskey even. We even had some, like a bunch of people ask us like, okay, we made fan art. Where can we send it to? Like, where do we send it? Yep, awesome stuff. And once we get some stuff in, we're going to do like an unboxing video for you guys. Yeah, so, so that'll yeah. be in the description uh, for those who have asked for it. Uh, it if, or if anyone else wants to send us stuff, that'll be where it is. Address down there. With that being said, Music Share Monday. Jukebox Share. I'm excited for some Foreigner. Yeah, so Come I've heard this. This was the first Foreigner song I ever heard, minus the one we did last week where we Cold both heard it. So now they're, yeah. I've heard two, you've heard one. Mm. And dude, I think it rips. Dude, I'm, I'm just excited, dude. Yeah. Solid All right. stuff. All right, with that being said, let's freaking get into this. Okay. Right. Standing in the rain mm. With his head hung low Couldn't get a ticket It was a sold out show Oh, dude Heard the roar of the crowd He could picture the scene Put his head to the wall Then like a distant scream He heard one guitar Ah, dude I know, man <laughs>
Dude. So, <laughs> this, I think this is the reason that I play guitar today. You really think so? I remember listening to this song before I was ever into music. I, I think I said it in the last Foreigner video. Yeah. And I listened to songs on my mom's iPod. And yeah. this just happened to be, she had like a bunch of comedy specials. And then and that like, was, that was the song. This there. was the other song she had. And then like a bunch of like other stuff that I didn't listen to. Like, I don't know, just yeah. mom stuff. Yeah. Like the Dixie Chicks. Um, and dude, I listened to this song on repeat on like the whole drive. There. It's like a two and a half hour drive. And every time I just imagine myself like, oh, what if I play guitar and I was that fucking cool? Yeah. Dude, I mean, it literally gave me goosebumps because I haven't listened to it in forever. Yeah. And it's like. That's awesome, dude. Dude, this is, I think the song that got me into rock and roll, got me into like playing guitar this is no dude this song is crazy and um just in regards to the guitar work itself i didn't know he had that type of solo in him you know those what I mean? chops dude oh yeah it was like it was dude just the flow of it was insane the way he built it up it was very like playful you can tell he wasn't like yeah trying too hard it was very like rhythmic for at, for, at first too before he started piercing through with these like, key notes and shit like yeah. that no just the writing of it and the way he carried himself was so just swag dude it was. A- absolutely he just owned it yeah. completely um for a large for probably the first like 25 percent of the song i felt like it was a strong like flat b for for a second until like that chorus dropped i was like yep. okay okay this is now a b plus kind of song just the way yeah. the chorus dropped in um and then when the guitar solo came i was like okay i'm feeling i'm feeling a now yeah. not a plus but a a strong 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 a so is that where you're, you're staying at the a yeah especially yeah. with the when the vocals started like yelling like screaming in towards the end it was just like strong a what okay. do you think it's hard. This is one you that's have, got you a have lot emotional of, connection with it. I've got a, inc- I've got a crazy emotional connection to it. So this is yeah. like the song that got me into wanting to play guitar. So I remember picturing it when I was a little kid. Yeah. So it's an anthem. It's an anthem, dude. It is anthemic. I'm. So for me, it's between A plus and S. I don't yeah. know if I like. I know. I think I can be. Like step myself back a little bit to say mm-hmm. maybe it's not S tier. When I think of all the other songs that have yeah. to be in that well, category. Well, I think there's a time and a place to step back and do that. But for a song like this, for yourself, I feel like that's not a time to step back and give so? it objective looks. I think, I think you have to dive dude, into I, the S. If you're feeling I don't think it's S tier, dude. It's, it just is that song that literally... Like, it gave me goosebumps during it. Because I, yeah. I remember listening to this, again, hours of time I spent listening to this one song. Because it was all I had to listen to. And it was the perfect song for a little kid to listen to at, like, Yeah, no, eight. it's awesome. Yeah. I don't know, man. I, I think breaking the song down as an adult... Uh, I think the vocal tone mm-hmm. is phenomenal. The guitar tone is phenomenal. Uh, the production style was very minimalist. Like mm-hmm. they didn't do a lot, but the thing is, they did like ramping the v- like where it's like uh, they use uplifters now to do that in modern music. I mean, it's a great uplifter. It's something that they mimic in today's music for a reason, and it came from mm-hmm. this style. So I think it's super cutting edge as far as that goes. Uh, the the little background guitar stuff. I don't know if you noticed it. Um, I hadn't noticed it until I just listened to it. Yeah. But they start turning up. He either starts digging in and playing wise, uh-huh. but I also think they start turning up the gain a little bit and okay. EQing it differently to open it up very subtly. Yeah. Where he's doing that background stuff, where the and sound out of da 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 when the drums yeah. actually start coming yeah. in, they they like tweak the tone of it so it slowly ramps up to where it blooms right at the start of that. Mm-hmm. So again, acts as another uplifter. So they use a lot of these tricks that that every modern song uses, mm-hmm. and it comes from this era. So I don't know. It just I thought it was phenomenal. No, I, I, I think phenomenal. killer song. So, question is, are there other foreigner songs that we have to check out? Yeah, I hope so. There has to be more. I can't imagine they only have Cold as Ice and Jukebox Hero. There's, there's more. There's more, and they're gonna let us know because yeah. that's how, that's how it be. You so, know what I mean? Dang. With that being said, freaking great song to start off the <laughs> PO Box thing with, right? Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Can you see why I liked it so much? Yeah, dude. What, do you think if if you had heard it as a kid, it would make you want to play guitar? What was it? What was the song that made you want to play guitar? Probably a Pink Floyd song, right? No, I actually I didn't get into Pink Floyd until I was like a junior or senior in high school. Really? What first got me into guitar actually was um, "Sweet Child of Mine" by Guns N' Roses. You can see that because I, I learned to play the opening riff when I first picked up a guitar when I was like nine or ten years old. I played it very shittily, you know. Yeah. I listened and because I listened to the guitar solo, the second solo, obviously, and you're like, wow, this is like unattainable. Like people actually like some some entity did this you know yeah. it was so intriguing I didn't, I didn't get into guitar at that point it was years later that i picked it up for real after i listened to comfortably numb but but either way that, that, that was probably, that was probably the main song that got me artist. interested in guitar absolutely that's cool you know what if you stayed around this long uh why don't you tell us if you play an instrument what what was the song that you got you into it this not the one that you were like the first one you learned but like the song where it planted that seed of like i want to play music i'm just curious 
Yep. Yeah. That Let being said, catch you guys later.